Okay, so today we are multiplying integers, and I'm going to show you how to multiply integers for question 3, which I have to find each project for B and for D. Okay, so question B is negative 11 times negative 12 times negative 1. So, first you figure out what to do with the integer, since there's a negative with another negative, it's the same rule as subtracting, and adding integers, you get a positive. But since there's another negative here, negative beats positive, so the answer would be a negative. And since 11 times 12 is 132, it'd be a negative times 1, it's the same answer. Okay, so for question D, you got to do negative 2 times negative 3 times negative 4 times negative 5. And this is a negative, again, sorry, another negative. It would equal a positive. And then there's another negative, inside another negative. So that would equal another positive. Since the positives don't destroy each other, it would be positive. So negative 2 times negative 3 times negative 4 times negative 5 positive 120. That is the